that you didn't originally intend to go into the waste industry. Could you elaborate on that for us? Sure. Neil's an economist and an entrepreneur, and he knows an opportunity when he sees one. I've watched how quickly the aquaculture industry has grown, and I knew I wanted a chunk of that pie. I also knew I needed a marine biologist, and I knew exactly who to call. So he convinces me to start our own aquaculture business. For a dyed in the wool scientist, Holden took right to business. We developed a solid plan, but couldn't get around the problem of feed, which accounts for over 60% of production costs. The problem with fish meal is that we still have to catch fish to feed fish. It's diminishing wild stocks and removing the food source for commercially important snappers, groupers, and billfish. And it's just plain expensive. The price of fish meal has more than tripled in the last 15 years. So one day we asked, why can't we grow our own feed? And if we can make our own feed, why couldn't we make it for others? We were obviously going into the wrong industry. Why mine the gold when you can sell the shovels? And that's how we discovered the black soldier fly. These amazing insects are native to North and South America. The adults don't have a mouth, so they're incapable of biting, stinging, or spreading disease. Most of their life is spent as larvae, which voraciously consume organic waste. These guys essentially eat the smelly, sticky stuff that no one wants to deal with. Waste like sewage, fecal sludge, rotting vegetables, and livestock manure. This waste contaminates our groundwater and food products and spreads diseases. When this waste is collected, it's generally dumped into landfills and treating it is expensive. But our flies love this stuff. They eat more than double their own body weight every single day. And as they eat, they churn, aerate, and dry the waste, so there's no odor. The waste is reduced to castings. They can be used as fertilizer. And the larvae, they're self-harvesting, and they're rich in oils, proteins, and chitin. The oils can be pressed out and readily converted to biodiesel. We can make 90 grams of biodiesel from every kilogram of waste we put in. The chitin can then be extracted and sold. What's left is pure protein. Flyotech's black soldier fly meal formula is high in all 10 of the essential amino acids which are required by fish, and can be used as an inexpensive fish meal replacement. All of this from waste that people will pay us to take away. But to us, it's not waste. It's high nutrient organic inputs. Inputs that Flyotech converts into eco-friendly, high quality feed. Feed for Chilean grown trout, turbot, and salmon. Chile's robust aquaculture industry accounts for more than a quarter of all the seafood farmed in the Americas. We want our feedstock to fuel Chile's growing aquaculture demand. And feeding all of those fish is a big market. A market we intend to corner. Startup Chile, welcome to the fly cycling revolution.